coming weekend is usually reserved for big backyard gatherings and, of course, those 4th of July celebrations. But with COVID-19 infection rates rising in Oregon, Governor Brown has a message for families. Fox Hills' Brenna Kelly joins us live now to explain. Brenna. Well, Governor Brown is pleading for people to stay home. She says this upcoming holiday weekend is a critical point for Oregon in this pandemic. And to show just how serious she is, she instituted that statewide mask mandate today. The governor is asking people wishing to celebrate the 4th of July to keep their gatherings local and small in size. Health officials tracked a spike right after Memorial Day weekend, and they're worried the same thing could happen again. I know the weather's supposed to be fabulous over the 4th of July weekend. Want to encourage folks that were planning those huge backyard barbecue bashes with 100 of your besties um, to keep it really, really small to members of your household and to keep it local. I spoke to the chief epidemiologist Kimberly Rep with Washington County Public Health. They were seeing a significant increase in cases there. She says even though phase one allows gatherings of up to 25 people, she admits it's hard to physical distance with people you're comfortable with. So it's better not to host a backyard barbecue with anyone outside your household this weekend. Meanwhile, the governor says if the state continues down this path, she may need to follow another state's steps, closing restaurants and other businesses. You may remember Multnomah County was the last to enter phase one two Fridays ago. It's now aligned with Washington and Clackamas counties as a regional unit for future reopening decisions, which may be on hold for some time. I am a scientist. I'm not a politician. Uh, so all I can tell you is that if people are sick in quarantine, they're not going to be able to work anyway. The Oregon Health Authority collects metrics on which we evaluate whether we should open or close. We are almost failing every single metric data wise. So it would literally be against all available information to go any further. And in fact, the data say we should probably take a step back. And Governor Brown says another spike after this weekend could put Oregon in a dangerous position. The reality is hospitals and health care workers could become overwhelmed within weeks if people aren't careful. Reporting live in Portland, Brenna Kelly, Fox 12 Oregon.